In LumaFusion 2.0, enhanced keyframing gives Android editors the power to create smooth, beautifully curved paths as they move videos, images, and titles around the frame. Up until now, we could only move media in straight lines from point to point using keyframes in the Frame and Fit Editor. But now, with the new Path Editor, we have precise control over the motion of clips, an enhanced keyframing capability made possible with the power of Bezier curves. Bezier curves play a fundamental role in shaping the movement and trajectory of objects. These are mathematically defined to enable you to create smooth movements on screen using set control points influencing the curve's path. To get started, use keyframes to create a motion path for your media in the Frame and Fit Editor. Next, tap the Path Editor icon at the top of the interface. The yellow line on screen dictates the path of your media, with the white squares representing the keyframes placed on your clip. These will turn green when a keyframe is selected. These white handles attached to the keyframe enable you to change the shape of the curve moving in or out of a keyframe. See as I drag the handles left, right, up and down, the path dictated by this yellow line will adjust, and when I play the media back, my clip follows the path I've made as it plays through. Which handles you see on screen are dictated by the position of your playhead, so you can easily tell which portion of your path you'll be affecting. If you'd like to make a change, simply hold and drag on a handle to form a new path, or to reset a keyframe's curve to default, tap and drag the handle along the curve to the cross, and your handle will snap into its default position, ready for you to try again. These dots on the yellow path here demonstrate the easing between keyframes, so the rate of change at which the clip will move from A to B. The closer the dots are together, the slower the rate of change. The wider they're apart from each other, the faster the rate of change. This is altered in the Ease Editor, accessed via this icon. For example, when I lower the speed at which my clip is going to land at the second keyframe, you'll see back in the Path Editor that the dots are closer together, as opposed to at the start of the path where the clip will be travelling further from frame to frame. Integrating the use of easing alongside the formation of your motion paths will give you a more realistic and natural look as your media plays on screen. Back in the Path Editor, you can freely edit the path of your media until you're happy with the look and feel of your content. Adjust the position of clips, modify their paths, or even add or move keyframes as you like. Simply long press and drag a keyframe to move it left or right within your clip, or use the nudge icons to make fine adjustments. For a better view of the preview, use the Zoom Navigator to get a closer look at specific changes you're making, or zoom out to see your path from afar, where many editors like to move their media off screen for dramatic entrances and exits. To experiment with the different ways to animate the motion of your clips, why not check out the Creative Path presets in the top right of the Frame and Fit Editor? Tapping on these presets supplies ready-made keyframes with curved paths to your clips. You can use these for a quick edit or for creative inspiration. As you tap through, you'll notice the new keyframes replace those already on the clip, enabling you to edit with speed. If you want to create your own custom path presets and save your own for use time and time again, just tap the Save Preset icon when you're happy with an animation. Give it a name, and in future projects, you can apply it to your clips by selecting it from the presets library. Have fun with this new feature in LumaFusion 2.0 and get creative with the motion of your clips and titles to make your videos more eye-catching and immersive. And for a bonus tip, why not utilise this tool in the Colour and Effects Editor? With the Path Editor, you can control the motion of any effect with a centre point, enabling you to explore the imaginative ways your footage can transition as it plays through.